Thank you for um, giving me this opportunity to interview you. Uh, just begin by giving me your name, please. Sure. Um, my name is Daniel Lawless. Um, and why did you decide to do this uh, community reporters course? Uh, well, um, it's it's been quite interesting over the um, over the few weeks of um, uh, of uh, what, what was um, brought to us in other uh, other sessions. So um, eventually, I, I, I thought I might as well give it a go. What did you expect to achieve from the course? Uh, I don't know, probably just expand, um, expand on some things I partially already know. Um, you know, photography, video, audio, things like that. Is the course fulfilling your expectations? Yeah, it is, yeah, very, very uh -huh. much. What have you most enjoyed from it? Um, Well, uh, being, being able to um, put your own ideas to uh, uh, to um, a uh, a subject that you've you'd never th thought you'd um, be allowed to uh, to uh, put you know put into if you know what I mean. And if you know, uh, give a, give a whole new outlook on the. And the subject, so subject that you could be working on. Um, and what, with regard to the length of the course, what do you think? Um, to me, it seems a little bit short. You no, know, it could be. Um, I think it could have been a, l a little longer, say about a couple of weeks or so. Um, in what ex in what ex um, how could it be extended? What do you think is missing or? Um, well, I think that, uh, with the audio aspect, I think I think I think they could have expanded it a little, say, uh, giving you a little bit more bit, bit more time to to develop the skills. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Can you tell me your name, please? So uh, my name is Mark Watts. I work for Break for UK, based over in Albert. I believe you've been doing the Community Reporters course? That is correct, yes. Can you uh, just tell me, why did you decide to do the course? Well, um, I mostly decided to do the course really because um, at, the at the time um, Breakthrough was trying to get, get using social media to try and market us really and, um, and I only well, use them social media such as Twitter, Facebook and YouTube mostly but I've not had the chance to use, use social media a bit more more long term, so I thought, I thought that it would be in my best interest to take go on this course, so then it could come in handy um, in regards to help breakthroughs to use social media more. So that's why you decided to to do the course? Yeah, right? that is correct, yes. Uh -huh. um, is the course fulfilling your expectations? Well, I have to admit, it is, it is quite surprising. Plus, also, um, I found it quite interesting, particularly in, in in some of the parts regarding about um, editing a video. I've edited audio before a few times when doing audio formats, but for the video itself, that's something I've never tried really, to be honest. So I've, I've found it to be pretty interesting in, in editing video. And of course, I've, 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 I've taken pictures quite a few times for Breakthrough before, as well as in written reviews of articles. I, I mainly be in the edit of the newsletter, actually. What have you most enjoyed about the course? Well, I guess so. What I've enjoyed about it is, is, is learning about some of the some some of the skills I've, I've not learnt before, like um, manipulating video. I've, I've always been mostly been, been doing all that with, with audio. I've experimented a few times myself, but but using using audio a bit more like this is it's a bit more interesting. I can tell you, it's really interesting and in how I've done quite a few a few things. But um, but the video is something that's really got me interested. What do you think about the actual length of the course? Well, the length is, um, at the moment, it's kind of too early to tell, even though I'm about, we're about halfway through. But um, I, I'm, I'm hoping to see that um, things get a bit more interesting. I guess the big challenge I've found is um, trying to come up with new ideas for, so that we can upload to the Community Report website. That's been a challenge for me. Hi, can you just tell me who you are, please? Hi, I'm Richard Curry, and I'm uh, a rights control design group member, and I'm taking part in the people's books.
training. And um, why did you decide to do this course? Well, I think it's really interesting. Um, I really like the way it um, talks about different forms of media and what we can do with them. And I basically just wanted to get more skills. So like as disabled people or people with mental health impairments, we could learn how to create our own stories and interests. And what did you expect to achieve from the course? Well, I was hoping that I'd have a very basic understanding of some of the basic principles of journalism, like how to write a story, how to do an audio interview, and how, like we're doing today, to create video. Um, I was hoping to become more rounded at these things. Is the course fulfilling your expectations? Uh, absolutely. You know what? And it's really, um, it's really kind of going beyond my expectations in the fact that it's very fun, it's very creative. And what have you most enjoyed about the course? I think it's been a fun challenge and I think we're all learning from each other and helping each other and I think that's the best way to do things. What do you think about the length of the course? Um, Personally, I feel like we all have strengths and weaknesses in terms of sections of the course, like audio or, you know, video or, um, you know, written, uh, the written side of things. And I'll possibly like a bit more time on certain things to get a bit more used to it. But apart from that, the length is good. Thank you very much. Thank you.